Blender just dropped a massive update and I hope you have your bag stacked up because now could be the last time before this absolutely explodes. <laughs> Welcome back to Crypto Games. What am I talking about? And for all those people that were dropping comments on Blender's Twitter saying, uh, just give me a minute. It's not decentralized. Uh, they're using Amazon Web Services. <laughs> Guys, this could absolutely explode the price now. And actually, I'm seeing it happen already. And I think in the long term, this can perform extremely well. Up 21% at the time recording this video. It's had a big drop. But watch it. We've officially shifted from AWS to a fully decentralized GPU network, you best believe. It was long. I thought this was going to take long. It says, which allows users to lend and rent GPUs directly now through the Blender network, Space Blender network. So you can click on that, takes you over there, log in with your MetaMask. I did it, I looked, I saw the back end. You can now do this in a decentralized way. This is a big look for them. Why is it listen? I logged in a few days. There you go. So come check it out. Log in, come check out the back end. They've already got some GPUs up and running already, which is good. This is a big look. Experience, let me make this more, show more. Experience seamless peer-to-peer -peer GPU access for all of your AI and rendering needs. And it could be for gaming, it could be for movies. This could be for anything, right? Join us in the revolu... Re join us in... Re <laughs> my words. In revolutionizing the... Hold on. Revolutionizing the future of computing. So this was a big update. This was on the 3rd of July. And take a look at the price. I ain't done no price unless I'm to be some price unless... <laughs> yeah. Just look at this. So here's your disgusting drop of all of the, you know, the weak hands. This is where we saw massive capitulation. All of the people that got shook. Massive... Sem what is it? 75 and 80% dump. <laughs> I'm laughing because there's an opportunity. Now look at the RSIs. RSI shows when prices are oversold, which it was down here, and it shows when it's overbought. This looks like it's starting to curve and come back up. And if this RSI starts to come up like this, you're going to see massive price action, guys. And there's serious amounts of room for this to come up before it gets overbought. Serious amounts of room. I wonder if we're going to see a massive rally for Blender Network. And all those people that sold, that got shook off the price and the fear and uncertainty, you're going to kick yourself. Because now could be the time that it starts to shift round. We will see anyway. Um, this is a long-term hold for me. I just wanted to bring this update. It's a big update. And um, obviously now it opens the doors to show people that they are fully decentralized and they're doing this. Look at this. Look at the stochastic RSI. This is buying momentum. This is people buying it up. I told you, people are secretly buying this. You see these greens. These are whales buying this like a boss. I know people that are spending huge amounts in this, right? And they've been catching every dump, right? Not just me. So secretly, you're seeing a signal, which is the, the stochastic RSI, which is buying momentum coming right up. And this is it. So because the buy power is there, and this, this has just come out of this like the lowest zone of oversold, that was your opportunity down there. And patrons, this is where we've been buying, all down here. So let's see what happens now in the future. If we can see this come right up and follow what I'm showing you on this yellow line and see if it can come right up into the oversold area. Hopefully by then, I mean, just if this goes back to where it went, if it does some form of a V-shaped recovery, which, I don't know, it might take a few days to play out because this is a daily time frame, right? Um, if it does something like this, I, I don't know if it happens straight away because, you know, really you want a V-shape right, right away. But if it does something like that, just from there to there is, is a big, hold on, let me just get the uh, thingy up. It's a big move. You're talking, hold on, where's the measuring tool? From here. You're talking from here to here. That's like 282%. <laughs> Let's see if it can do it. Can, and that's just $2. And you know what the mad thing is? If it does that, it can happen quicker than what I'm thinking because the supply is so tiny. 50 cents to $1 seems like a, uh, like a big lump, big jump. It's like, oh my God, it's a dollar now. But 42 million tokens in supply, that's all there is. 
you won't ever get any more than 42 million tokens in supply. And let me just show you Litecoin as an example for low supply, right? Litecoin has about 80 something million. And look at the prices that Litecoin is sitting on. Remember, this is 50 cents. Litecoin is $62. I'm just saying, it's got double the supply, 84 million. So I think that Blender could go into the hundreds of dollars in the future if it performs really well. If you hear something about AI or one of the big computers, you know, Microsoft, Google, Nvidia, Nvidia, what you want to call it, start to talk about GPU processing and how it's going to be an important thing. <laughs> Watch this fly. Watch it fly. Now is the time, not financial advice. Do what you want to do. I know where I'm stacking up. Now is your lot, probably your last chance because prices can't stay down here forever. I think that we might see a reversal and this chart speaks of an, a reversal. So let, where are you buying it? Are you buying it when you know it was right over uh, overbought? Because essentially it launched. Let's just, let's just be real here. <laughs> the project launches. It's probably up here in the RSI because you can't see it in a few days ago. Overbought. And then all we did was see a, a sell-off from the launch because it launched and then, you know, prices fell down. Look, and now it's down here, oversold. I'm going to leave it here. If it was helpful, drop that like and subscribe. What do you think of this? This is a big, big update. Shout out to uh, Blender team. I don't even know if they watch my stuff because it's not sponsored. It's just me being a big fan of the project and I, I love everything AI right now. So, yeah, and I'm going to show you some more AI stuff as well. Thanks for watching. Become a Patreon, links in the info section. I'll see you in the next video. Cheers.